it's Fantasia and welcome to another mod review. So this one is actually called the Mean Teen Mod and I think you guys are really gonna like this if you play in my type of gameplay style where it's very like realistic and you can add some drama, then I think you guys are gonna really, really love this. So before we get into it, we're gonna do our notification shout out. So this one goes to Dummy. Thank you so much for supporting me for that long. It is crazy that I actually remember when I was at 20K and oh my goodness, just thank you so much for the love and support. I appreciate you times a million. And if you guys want to chance to be in a notification shadow, all you gotta do is comment down below. So let's just jump straight on into this. So this is really fun because first of all, I do want to mention this is by Percy. I'm going to link it down below. So currently this is on Patreon, but as you guys know, everything on Patreon does become free. So if it's not free now, it will be. And so basically this just kind of adds more parent teen relationship. And the description of this, it actually says making their life toxic, controlling, overprotected. And you guys will see what that all means. So basically, Basically, when you have a teenager, which she's a teenager and this is the mother, you're going to be able to click on the teen and then you can go to more choices and you're going to see this mean teen pie menu. So this is going to also pop up for both. So if we click on the mother with the teen, it still pops up here. So this is pretty interesting. It's very realistic. So when we go to mean teen, it says talk about preferred university, talk about independence, nag about their style, ask if they finished homework, ask if they applied for universities, ask if they applied for scholarship, argue about their friends, argue about scholarships. We have yell out for not yell at for not answering the phone, try to listen and talk about you universities. So these interactions, they're meant to be the parent, like saying it to the teenager. And these are all things that like teens get nagged about. And you know, you know, like the, maybe the teen is rebelling. And I really, really like this. It just so adds to the whole storytelling for teenagers. We need more stuff that make teens be like teens. So this is perfect. Even when it comes to nagging about their style, maybe like the teens in a rebellious stage, all of a sudden they change their style They're They want tattoos. They want all these piercings and their parents don't like that. So then you can nag about the style. So we're going to go ahead and just do ask if they finished homework. So there's a lot of new moodlets with this, which I absolutely love. This is something I love about Percy's mods is just the amount of moodlets. It's so great. So let's just let them talk. I did just film a video on this mod, by the way, if you guys are wondering about these little bikes, um, you guys can check that out on my channel. Um, but yes, so they're just chatting. I don't know why everyone's trying to join their conversation, but we're not going to worry about it. Um, we're just going to let them talk and hopefully look at this mood lip. Okay. So she's currently uncomfortable. Love that. Um, I'm going to actually, I think I'm going to cue them up a little bit. Let's talk about independence as well. And then let's go ahead and do mean teen and let's do, we could argue about scholarships. Let's do that one. So the argue about scholarships is actually a mean interaction, which I also like, you know, it actually, you know, they're different from one another. So let's go ahead and we will yell at for not answering the phone. So this is perfect if you have your teen go out and they are just not answering their phone. So that would be perfect for that. Um, you could like plan it all out where they actually don't answer their phone. So I like that. Um, so let's see here. We haven't experienced any new moodlets yet but they actually should be having some. But let's go ahead and just continue and see if they start popping up. We'll argue about their friends. So maybe the parent doesn't like their friends. Here we go. Okay, the moodlets do work as I thought. Oh my gosh, you guys. So D Discipline a Teen says, the main reason for giving pocket money is to help children learn to manage money while they are young and you can still guide them. But once they become rude and disrespectful, it is the best way to teach them how to control their anger. Then it says bad influence. Jocelyn isn't trying to judge, but she noticed some talk toxic people from her child's friends and had to tell them. Wow. Okay. So she's just angry from this. And we also have cut pocket money. Lexi hates it when the parent punishes her this way. If they keep being this mean, she might run away. Oh my God. All right. So let's continue. This is interesting. I love it. All right. So mean teen, let's go ahead and try to listen. So she's very uncomfortable. She's very angry. We have a lot going on and let's go ahead and do mean teen and and ooh, we can punish severely, you guys. Okay, so let's just talk about university, see if we get anything there. And then, oh, look, I'm clicking on the wrong sim. <laughs> okay, and then let's go ahead and ask if they apply to universities. Let's do that one. And then let's do the, uh, let's do the punish severely. I'm interested in that one. All right. So it doesn't look like they got any new moodlets for those. I'm not sure if it's more so like, you know, some things don't give you a moodlet or if they don't give you a moodlet every single time. Oh my God. What is happening here? <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. 
we're gonna ask if they applied for scholarship again and okay we got another thing a stylish mother jocelyn doesn't like her child's style she wants them to wear some classic and mature clothes oh my god okay and then she actually got a moodlet for that as well feeling down from being judged i will never be who my parent wants me to be and i will never wear the trashy clothes they want me to <gasps> oh my goodness wait i love this sorry about this random house by the way i filmed other mod reviews in here and then i filmed the update video when we got um some new clothes and the new food in the game so yeah everything's just all over the place <laughs> so don't mind that but yeah these moodlets are everything i really enjoy this okay so this is going to be like just perfect for let's plays and everything so let's talk about the preferred university again so once you do certain things you can't keep doing them but i'm gonna assume that you can do them again after a little while like right now as you can see like that's pretty much all we can do um i just had her do it twice and then on her end okay so here look okay hold on we gotta go over this you guys so under her there's some different stuff it says discuss quitting school confess wanting plastic surgery confess not wanting university studies confess hating the house this house rules uh be disrespectful in Ask to invite friends over. Ask to, oh, it says it twice. Okay. <laughs> Ask if they can throw a party. Oh my God. This is so fun. Try to convince them to let her party. Try to communicate. Talk about moving on. Talk about insecurities. Uh, talk about independence. Talk about her future job and say hurtful things. Okay. Let's talk about insecurities. We're going to do a bunch of things. She also changed. I, oh, well, I'm just going to keep it like that for now. Um, and then let's discuss quitting school because I definitely want to see all of these uh, moodlets. Confess wanting plastic surgery. Let's ask to invite friends over. I like that. Like you have to ask permission. I really, really like that. Confe confess to hating the house rules. So we'll do that one. We can talk about moving on. Okay. And then let's talk about independence. And then, oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. And then convince to let, oh my God, let them, wait, try to convince them to let her party. Oh my God. Oh my God. I love, this is so cool, you guys. So these moodlets, some of them give you, or no, these interactions, some of them give you moodlets, some don't. Um, I also don't know if you can get like a bunch of different moodlets at a time, but either way, it, uh, guys, I'm going to have the link down below and you can see all the possible moodlets that you can get. There's a lot of them and this is amazing. I love this, you guys. Like I love anything like this. I mean, these type of mods are just so much fun to me. I don't know what it is about them, but we need more interactions in the game, I feel, especially ones that are specific to different ages i just feel like we need very specific interactions and everything for teens and you know this just gives us a little bit of that so yeah i'm not seeing any new moodlets right now but i'm looking over at the post right now and there is a lot of different moodlets that you can get i just think maybe you don't get them every single time or you can't have like a million at once i'm not really sure but you guys i love this so much so i'm gonna have it linked down below highly recommend it if you just like you know things that give you different uh interactions for different age groups this mod creator does a really great job of creating mods like this this one as she said was requested from people who you know play with her mods so yeah she also has other ones that give more interactions for like kids and everything like that just really really great so you guys with that said i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope you guys are all having an amazing amazing day and don't forget to leave some positivity down below i love you guys all so so much and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys Honestly, I'm open I don't feel like waking up without you by my side I still see your silhouette Why don't we go back to Why don't we go back to your bedroom?